This season, though, in catches and touchdowns, but he does see point out of a chance to make a big splash in the Super Bowl tomorrow night. And he's already said he wants to come back and play another season. Now, we'd like to say you're going to take your pick on the game and the score, but we don't want to sway public opinion. You, know, you, you don't want to hear my pick. Is the phone oh, What's that again? That's 44 <laughs> five. Something crazy. Uh, both Steve and John make their predictions come tomorrow morning. That's it for now. Sports Center's covered. The Super Bowl 47 rolls on from the world. Steve Young, John Bruton. I'm Steve Lee. The Steve and Steve thing has a nice ring. I like it. Mike, I can do it. We can take it. Straight home game as they beat Miami 102-89. David West for his third 30-point game of the season. And he had lost three straight to the Pacers. The Celtics winning their sixth straight versus the match 97-84. Boston really off three straight following a six-game losing streak. Like Rajon Rondo, Jared Sellinger out for the season. He has a bad back head surgery. Look at Jeff Green just dunking all over the feet. All right, the Clippers couldn't spoil Rudy Gay's first game with the Raptors. They got blown out to Toronto, scoring a season of 73 points. L.A. was held to 35% shooting and made just three of 19 from three. Chris Paul sitting out with a huge right kneecap. And the Lakers held on versus the Timberwolves, 111-100. L.A. snapping an eight-game road losing streak. And approved to 6-16 six on the road this season. And Dwight Howard's absence. Howard Salt, 22 points and 12 boards. All right, the Lakers have been more successful when Kobe Bryant is dishing the rock. When he dishes out six assists or more, L.A. wins nearly 70% of the time. When he has five or fewer, just a 24% chance of winning. He's coming off his fifth straight game with at least eight assists, the longest of his career. NBA Insider Israel Gutierrez joining us now. And Izzy, the Lakers finally enjoyed some room service for once, a rare win on the road. How the Soul scoring over 20 for just the third time this season. What are the chances that he plays his way back into the starting lineup? Probably not very good if you think about it. If you look at his success without Dwight Howard, it doesn't really support the idea that two bigs play well together in that system. It kind of supports the idea that they play better when they're on the floor one at a time, either or. So I would envision that when Dwight Howard does get back, that they basically tell Kyle Gasol, look, when you are on the floor, play just like that. 